All right, so I did this video the other day talk about Matthew McConaughey, shut your ass up, all right? But I did a card reading about a year ago that said, when the cat's away, the mice will play. And I said, right now, the left is falling apart everywhere you look. So Matt, they had to drag Matthew McConaughey because Hollywood, like it or not, is a part of this thing. And now we're seeing their puppets like Johnny Depp with that stupid ass trial. Now we're seeing all of a sudden Matthew McConaughey's at the White House going against the Second Amendment, which goes against who he tries to portray himself as, as the Texas Longhorn guy. He's always at the college games, Mr. This and That. He's one of us. He's a normal guy like one of you and me. He ain't a normal guy like you and me. It's a million dollar actor right there, okay? And now he's getting up in front of the Washington, D.C. press and everything and going against the Second Amendment taking off the veil, showing us who he really is, and also, I think, was on a job interview. Because, think about it, the Democratic Party doesn't have anybody for a president, and they love to slide a handsome, good-looking actor instead of Sleepy Joe. Because Sleepy Joe was on Jimmy Kimmel the other night, and it looked like Jimmy Kimmel was just feeding and pudding, all right? Like a little choo-choo or airplane. Choo-choo, here it comes. Sleepy Joe's like, ah, more pudding, more vanilla pudding. It's terrible what's going on with this, this Democratic Party because it's ran by far-left psychopaths, okay? They want to cut the gas lines, raise the gas prices, inflation's off the hook, off the chain, everything's going crazy, and they're trying to put up Matthew McConaughey in the White House to distract us. And dude look like a straight idiot. And I got the best card I could have got for him on this card reading. It's the magician because an actor is a magician, Okay? He knows what he's doing. He knows what he's doing when he plays his part. He knows exactly who he is. That will have, I will never cut him any slack that I've got this, pulled this card on him, all right? This is one of the major cards in the deck, all right? The magician. What does a magician do? He sh does the sleight of hand while he's tricking you. The magician can trick you, okay? Matthew McConaughey is aware of what he's doing. Every time the camera's on, he is aware of what he is doing with his body because he, he is a professional actor and his craft is to trick you and make you believe that person in front of that camera is who he wants you to believe he is. And I believe he was acting for the presidency. I believe he was putting an idea out there for him, for them, because that would be the ultimate acting job. We'll get into that later about the eye in the sky and the pie in the sky. But for right now... I pulled this during the cats away, the mice will play. They are bleeding out slow. The left is desperate. I was thinking about it earlier. It's kind of like when you got that grab and go bag. You know, you got your money in it. You got your gold. You got your passport. Well, right now, they're pulling out all the stops. They're pulling out Hollywood. They're pulling out McConaughey. They're pulling out Johnny Depp. They're pulling out Joe Biden. They're pulling out Kimmel. Kimmel had to finish when he was, you know, giving him scoops of pudding. He had to finish uh, Biden's sentences for him because he was so brain dead. Okay. So they're trying to find a replacement for him. And you got their actors. They're kind of putting them out there like, you like this? You like that? Because they're bleeding out slow. They are going down hard. They're getting hit from all angles. The innocence is lost, and it's almost sad to see. And that's why you have that heart bleeding out there. Because there's a lot of actors, a lot of people from Hollywood that people respected and, and looked up to that are showing themselves, taking off their mask. Mr. Texas, turns out he wants to take in your guns, and he was standing up there in Washington saying, I'll sit up here and read this teleprompter and do, tell them whatever the hell they want, because I really don't give a damn about the American people. All right? And I thought about this because this card summed it up really well. I pulled this for Ted Cruz. If you look here, this guy is on a path with the woman, all right? And he's looking for that pie in the sky. He's got big dreams and aspirations. He didn't pay attention to the gypsy that sold him the map. The gypsy told him a couple important details, but he was too busy on his agenda that he just went, okay, that's fine, and he went on his way. Now, this guy, this is like the Oscar that McConaughey has. He doesn't care about it anymore. He has gold. He has money. So what does he want now? I think power and influence. And the way to get there is through the White House. That would be the ultimate acting job, to play the president in real life. And this woman right here is like the duality. She doesn't even have her shoes on, her ragtag dress is going on, and she's just like, I want that. I want that. And this is kind of him, if you look at it, just like Ted Cruz. And sometimes she can slide off the mountain. She's not careful. And that's what McConaughey did when he went up there and supported getting rid of the Second Amendment, okay? 
getting rid of our guns. He showed himself. He slipped off the mountain. Normally, he's cool. He's the other side of the pillow dressed. He's got his money. He's got everything in coordination. He's the magician. But sometimes he gets lost, and then we can see him for who he is, not paying attention, out on the cliff, looking for that pie in the sky, just like Ted Cruz does. And this one is very, very funny right now. It's the fortune card, because I think the fortunes of the left in Hollywood have took a turn. They've been winning for so long, they're so comfortable, that they don't know how to handle it now that the jig is up and the wheels are being reversed on their fortune. Fortunes are definitely being turned right now. You can see that. It's clear as day. So the wheel of fortune can spin and give you a life like McConaughey, and it can also spin and start to destroy everything in your foundation. And we're seeing that with the left. People are coming out and they can't not see what's going on. You know the prices have gone up everywhere you look, and they're continuing to go up. And as they parade, actors like McConaughey and Kimmel, we're starting to see that Hollywood is part of this agenda. Rock supported Biden. All of these people, and they have to play their part. And when they get called up to the big leagues and they got to go to the White House and read a teleprompter, they'll do it because that's what they signed on to. Who knows how deep that goes? Those Oscars don't mean a thing to McConaughey. Look what happened when Will Smith won an Oscar. He slapped the hell out of Chris Rock. These Hollywood puppets are at Ed's, they're at the razor's edge right now, okay? Because they're the grab and go bag and they're being used right now and implemented. And if you just open your eyes, you can see it. And so now we know McConaughey is aware of what he's doing because he's a magician and he's practiced his craft. And his craft is to fool you to believe who he is once that camera light goes on and clicks red. All right? With that being said, we'll talk later, Holmes. Peace out.